Hey everyone! God, I'm so not feeling this right now. Anyways, it's finally Fortnite Chapter 2 and I've decided to make this video to help you guys out when it comes to changing your Fortnite email address. Now, there's going to be two methods of doing this. First, I'll cover the simple one that works if you have access to your Fortnite account and the second which is going to be applied to those that do not have access to their email address. So you're not going to need anything special for this, it is all free, nothing shady so don't you worry. This is going to be a guide on how to change your email address in Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 1. So let's get right into it. Alright, so here we are on my beautiful desktop. Anyways, um, first things first, you're going to open your internet browser. I have Google Chrome. If you're using something else, open it doesn't really matter. And what you want to type into Google is Epic Games. Okay, so this should pop up saying uh, epicgames.com. That's their official page if you didn't know. Um, you want to click on that. And this glorious page will open. Anyways, what you need to do next is actually sign in. So as I said, we're doing the first method where you have access to your account. So basically what you want to do is just sign in. Type in your credentials here. And press on login now. Okay, so here we are. I'm supposed to be signed in. Yeah. So the way you know what if you're signed in or not is by your username or your in-game name popping up on the right side of the screen up here. Uh, you want to hover over with your mouse uh, and press an account. What's up, Evie? Um, this new page will open. It's uh, basically your settings and so on. Um, what you want to do is scroll all the way down until you see contact and address information. You want to click on the email address. And there it is. Um, what you want to do here is uh, type in your new email address. And just a note before you do it, I just want to say it even says here, a security code verification is required to make this change, which means that you're going to get a security code on your old email address that you have right now and on your new email address as well. So you're going to have to go there and confirm the changes. Um, also, you will not be able to change the email address again for 90 days, aka three months after this change is saved to this account as well it says here what you want to do basically is just type in your new email address right here in this box you want to press on confirm and that's about it it is as simple as that it's an official way that you use to change your email address and now there is the second way and that is if you do not have access to your account so basically what you want to do is make an epic games account doesn't matter which one any account and you want to press on need help right here actually you want to repeat the steps where you log in and everything you want to go into your account settings and press on need help right here Okay, so this page will open and this is basically the support center. Um, what you want to do next is uh, click on contact us right here. Okay, so um, here you'll have a bunch of choices. You do not want to select Fortnite even though this is for Fortnite. You want to go with Epic Accounts. Platform, basically just select the platform you're playing the game on. I'm playing on the PC, so it's PC. Language, this is basically the language that is going to be used in the email. You have some choices here, actually. I'm just gonna go with English. Your name here, this is optional, but I advise you to type in the full details, like give as much details as you can. So if there is your name on your account that you cannot get into, you basically wanna type in your name, right? Your email address, make sure this is not the email address of your old account that you cannot access. This is the email address that you want to use for the contact. So basically in the email address, you will receive an answer from the Epic Games support. Anyways, the next section right here, uh, you want to select and it depends on what your issue is. So if your account has been hacked, you want to go with hacked account. And if you just want to update your um email and you cannot update it with the method one for whatever reason you want to click on update account and basically here you want to describe your problem what it means to describe your problem is if for example your account got hacked basically you have to tell them when you lost access to your account what ip you've used what ip are you using if it's static or stuff like that um they're basically going to ask you a bunch of questions like your last purchase purchase history 
I have no idea. Stuff like that that will make sure that they confirm the ownership of your account that like it actually belongs to you because there's a lot of people trying to scam and that honestly won't work like if you're trying to scam accounts or like trying to get accounts that are not yours just forget about it already like they have a pretty good security system so basically you're going to send them an email and they're going to answer you back on the contact email address that you've uh, typed in above and they're gonna ask you a bunch of questions so make sure to have answered to them all so if that's the case and you got everything right your account will be returned to you so that's literally it there is no other ways to change your emails and i repeat like there is no other ways to change your email or gain an access to the lost account than this that's all there is to it really there's no magic there are no hacks no nothing as i said everything is free and official and yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it helped you a lot. Use creator code Anber in the item shop. It helped me a lot. And honestly, that's about it. So have an amazing day and peace out.